Hello YouTube, today I'll be showing you how to make this cute little Santa hat and it's not that big actually, it's like my hand, as big as my hand I guess and yeah that's pretty much what I'm going to show you and it's really really simple to make so stay tuned if you want to know how to make it. For the materials we will need a needle red and white felt, red and white, red and white thread, some stuffing, scissors, and that's all you need. For the template, you'll just need two um, circles from white felt, two rectangular pieces from red felt, and two of these long strips from white felt. To get this long strip, You'll just need to cut off these um, triangular pieces in one. It's just one shape. Um, you can get it from. To make it more easier, you just um, draw a rectangular piece, piece, and so you copy it from red felt. And when you finish um, copying it with two of that, you'll just cut off the bottom and get it from. So I cut off that thing I just copied it by the way so it kind of is confusing but it's actually pretty easy so you just want to get that kind of shape and that's what you need for this stitching we will start off with these two uh, four pieces and we will just saw a fell stitch up here show you so we also I'll stitch up here so it's right up there and to the side and if you want you can do a blanket stitch in the bottom but I prefer a fell stitch once you finish that you should have something like that So you should have something like that. Next, what we want to do is we want to attach those circle pieces. But before we do that, we need... So before you do that, we want to make them aligned. So what we want to do is we want to just put those things back to back. And then put one piece there and another piece the back just like that and then you want to put some marks in there so take your pen and then put some marks where the lines are like that and then another one just right there and then what we want to do is we want to, we just want to, oops, we just want to put those pieces like back to back and then we want to stitch all around and leave a gap there. So I'll come back to you when I've done that. Before you go to the mat. You just want to stuff it because when you put the stuffing, it won't really fit. So I'll just put some stuffing in. So it's stuffed and you just want to continue there. If you want to get those marks off, you just want to wash it. So wash it. Um, you can use cold or hot. 
so I'll just use hot because it's much, much easier when you use hot water. And you just want to squish it like that to take the water off and then let it dry or you can wipe it with something so I'll just wipe it with this and it will come out dry next we want to just um oh well, actually I did a blanket stitch um we just want to do blanket stitch around this so we're just gonna put that back to back and then we're gonna do a blanket stitch around and then I'll show you how to um, put that in there now you just want to make sure that you didn't stitch the bottom like that because what we will do is you want to stitch that in so I just want to put that in like that and then we want to stitch it with white thread don't use um, red because it will be very very visible see if you did um, red it will be visible to white so you want to use white and then how I would probably stitch it is I would start from the back well, actually, that's the front. So I would start at the back like that. Well, actually, I'll do um, smaller stitch like that. Um, you can start at the middle if you want, which I am doing right now. So we want to pull that bit in, and then we want to. Like, it's like foul stitch. So, just want to do that and continue that. Oops. So, we just want to continue that. I'm doing, I'm just trying to get it off, sorry. Because oh, it kind of, I'm having trouble right now. So, like that and then so that's at the back you want to do that again it's just like foul stitch but like a little bit more difficult so that's just what we want to do and you want to just continue that and there you go Kinda of easy here now. What you would just, you just wanna do is you wanna um do a blanket stitch at the bottom and you are finished. So and don't forget as you go on stuff. So it is fluffy and squishy. <laughs> so if you um stitch the bottom, it should look something like that and you that's that for the Santa hat and I hope you like this video. Thanks for watching. Bye!